Hey, Andrew Beaton here. I just wanted to thank you for uh, coming and checking this out. I know a lot of people are having some issues with uh, something called SV cmx.exe or vmx client you know online there's really no way to take it out and even in my computer uh i i went through everything even i mean everything and so the administrative privileges it tells you you do not have access if you try to see it in your task manager you try to delete it it does not delete it says you don't have sufficient privileges so you also can't even run your antivirus i mean it is it is malware uh, it's the next stage of malware. So I found a way, finally found a way around it. So, uh, you know, I've, I've done everything from, you know, editing the code in, you know, C++ to, you know, but everything, um, it, it, you know, it, it, it's working now and I, I did not expect it to work. So there is a solution and here it is. I'm going to tell you the solution. What I did, the, finally, the last thing I, out of a billion things that finally worked, um, was to create a batch file. Somehow, it's not requiring any administrative permissions and literally kills the task um, in your, in, from your uh, Windows Task Manager. So what I did is I created a task, uh, a task kill batch, and I went down and you know everything in my my Task Manager that just seemed illegitimate. Even though there's an Nvidia, I mean, I don't believe that's real. I think it's they're they're pretending to be Nvidia, you know, and then. Uh, I'm a computer guy, but you know Windows is it's it's quite uh with malware they're just getting more advanced. So copy this exactly. I'll put it right in the description. Nobody has had any way around this, but finally here is a way to do it. I finally found it because I don't know about you, but when it's hogging your CPU and slowing your computer down and even replicating itself to take all your storage, it's ridiculous absolutely ridiculous you know I, I took some time in between I've got a bunch of clients right now that are asking me for automation programs and here I am you know uh, it's taking some time out to to make sure my computers are right so couldn't find anything online so here it is svcmx.exe and there's a vmx client.exe uh, you know th there's a bunch of illegitimate ones that nobody has been able to get rid of so here it is here's the solution um, l let me know what you think in the comment selection. Like this video, share this video. I know a lot of people have been having issues with this, uh, especially with Windows 7. So, but yeah, in between, you know, writing programs for clients for automation, you know, I was able to do this and, uh, you know, finally it worked. And I am so absolutely excited about this. So what you do is you copy and paste this, paste this into a notepad or, or a note file. What you're going to do is you're going to go save as you want. This is really important. Save as. And then when it comes up, you want to name it dot bat, B-A-T, dot bat, whatever you're going to put, dot bat, okay? Save it, put it at your desktop, click it, and there it is. It kills all your tasks that are running. Um, and, you know, it's, it's, it's pretty amazing. I, I never thought uh, I was going to get around the SVC MX, but here you go. If you liked it, share it. Thank you so much. We'll talk to you soon.